boys this is all of the need for speed unbound gameplay so far that we have and i haven't even seen all of the footage but you know it's time to get up to speed with the game so let's see what we have here choose your driving effects oh lord bro this is what i was afraid of the cartoony effects yep over here you can choose your effects well it is what it is i was really hoping this is not true but i guess the game is gonna be full of cartoony effects there's like sparks flying everywhere <laughs> but guys if you would remove all of the effects and all of the user interface it would look pretty cool actually does anyone know if we can actually disable all of the effects would look pretty good that way right i was kind of hoping we get something similar to need for speed heat I mean, the garage area looks pretty similar. Over here, we have an eclipse. New decals. Okay, so we can do liveries. Gotta do them anime weeb liveries. Yep. Yeah, let's add some flowers as well. I mean, it looks pretty dope though. But the livery part is not what concerns me. Panel deletes. Okay, we can delete panels. So we can do bumper deletes. Nice. Very clean looking R34 over here. And boom, it's not so clean anymore. Okay, the rims. Man, what are those, bro? Pizza rims? Okay, these look really weird. Are these like special rims? I hope we have some normal rims as well. Is it just me who thinks these look a little weird? Maybe these are special racing rims? Or maybe this is what gives us the effect on the rims. Different rims, different effects, maybe? I don't know, I wouldn't go with these rims. What is that, a BMW? Legendary Customs. Oh, I mean, the body kits do be looking wild. Kind of like a Need for Speed hit. That Defender is probably new to Need for Speed, right? I don't remember this car in previous Need for Speed games. Although, I really like the stock looking car. I don't think I would go with a crazy body kit. I'm glad we can at least use the default cars. We don't have to upgrade. But that Defender is really dope. I do like that. And I did check how much this game is gonna cost. 70 bucks! Alright, here's a longer gameplay we have. Uh, is that a Lotus? At least we have cops in this game. I mean, that's lovely. But again, you can see these uh, cartoony effects over here. Not a big fan of that. Honestly, when I was looking at the trailer gameplay at first, I was hoping it's just a trailer, not in the actual gameplay. And guys, as for graphics, I don't see really big improvements over like Need for Speed Heat. Nothing mind-blowing. Am I crazy? And bro, the wings. When you do jumps, you get wings. Like, who asked for that? So someone in the team was like, yo, let's make this game as cartoony as possible. And everyone was like, yeah, let's do it. And I've noticed there's like so much action going on in every single clip. Like there is no chill racing or cruising. Over here we have some kind of a challenges. Different weather options as well. Also, my crazy or games have like stopped improving graphics. It feels like we have reached the peak of graphics. I'm not just talking about Need for Speed. So here we can do challenges against these uh, cartoon characters in the game. What is that? An RTR Mustang? I think it is. Oh, the characters in the car are cartoony as well. I didn't know that. Wait, did we even have characters in the cockpit in the car in previous games i think the cars were empty no i mean at least now we have characters in the game i'm really doing my best to find something positive over here the cop is still chasing the lotus over here i really hope the nld cop chases the police chases this has been the main reason that i play need for speed games the cop chases you know more footage over here uh, a lot of cartoony stuff over here honestly cartoony cinematics i'm kind of digging like this looks pretty dope if it's only cinematics the cinematics don't have to be realistic right a mean looking mercedes over here i don't even know are people overall hyped about the cartoon stuff or not for cinematics i'm all for it but are people generally hyped that the cartoon effects are in the gameplay as well like that guys don't get me wrong i'm still gonna get the game i'm gonna give need for speed unbound a chance obviously but for some reason i'm not hype for the game anymore and i'm still not sure why there's like circles coming from the rims in every clip who thought that was a good idea guys maybe it's just me getting old okay next year i'm gonna be 30 i don't watch cartoons anymore i'm sure there's gonna be a lot of people thinking this is the best thing ever made i do gotta say the cinematics look insanely good they definitely nailed that and what about the story mode over here i would really hope the game does not make the story easy like you really have to put effort in like there's gonna be like crazy bosses that are really difficult to defeat Feet. but nowadays all the games get just so easy maybe if people get stuck they just quit the game maybe that's why people don't want to be challenged anymore maybe i'm completely wrong let's see what you guys actually think about this game 
we're now gonna get to the spicy stuff okay so this is the official need for speed page over here in facebook all i want to see is the comments to be honest so we have some gameplay over here right uh let's see graphics look like a cartoon this looks more like a mobile game okay i'm not alone i didn't want to say anything but it looks like a complete mobile game now uh, let's see the next one over here why trying to reinvent the wheel while well, we just want an underground 2 and most wanted remastered yeah so a lot of people do want these older games remastered honestly i would be down for a brand new game as well if it comes out good right and there's people on the other side as well the game looks amazing don't listen to what the haters say another dude says this looks almost like a mobile racing game i get the same vibe it's just i'm not a hater i just get mobile game vibes it's just the vibe i'm getting i'm not saying it's a bad game it just looks like a mobile game i give up on the need for speed series from here on out come on don't give up hope the next need for speed game could be bonkers right or for all we know if we can disable all the effects it's gonna be lovely right yeah again people want the uh, remastered games over here another bust of a game should have remastered yeah people either hate the game they beg for remasters of the previous games or they love the game it seems now that's what i'm talking about with customizing options okay so customization people love that that's good this is going to be <laughs> such a sick mobile game <laughs> this is a mobile game right sorry for laughing it does feel like it Cool to see customization, but when are we gonna see if we get good physics? In my opinion, Need for Speed has never had good physics. This game has always been about everything else. Customization, the vibe, the police chases. I don't really care about the physics as long as the uh, steering wheel works. I'm just going to wait for this to be free. Well, I don't think the game is gonna be free. It's gonna be 70 bucks, okay? So, happy waiting, I guess. Someone says this looks more like Rocket League to me now. Also a fair point, yep. Someone said seriously. I'm sorry, what is this? Guys, wh what does this mean? I'm really confused. What is wrong with the width of the tire over here? If it had underground name instead of unbound, yo, people would be all over it. People always complaining. I would strongly disagree. I don't care about the name at all. I think the name is dope, unbound. Well, what's wrong with the name? Only thing I'm complaining about is the, uh, the sparks, the circles, the wings, the unnecessary effects. Do people complain about the name? Kind of confused over here. Oh, that is a good point. Guys, Need for Speed Pro Street kind of had similar vibe, right? I think it was way less cartoony, but I think people overall generally love that game so guys maybe we'll grow to love it i don't know bro this man agrees with me okay don't care about the races customization police chases have been a second thought for a long time how are the police chases need for speed unbound that's what i want to know as well so we need to address the uh the remakes i don't think need for speed remakes will ever happen never like you can quote me on that i don't think it's ever gonna happen i believe it was such a long time ago they probably don't even have like the game files anymore maybe it was like like a different company who helped them build the game or something like that i don't think that's gonna happen they could make a similar game i guess but i don't think we're gonna get the same game nowadays the more i see of this game the less interested i get been emulating the classics on keys since then i've done that as well really fun actually this dude says the last good need for speed for me was this one one of the most underrated as well need for speed carbon i i agree Bruh, underground and underground 2 we as well that's my childhood right there oh and again some people saying it looks like an android game as long as we can turn these effects off i'll be more willing to try this game i mean this is like the classic boomer take right like everyone who is like close to 30 or something they're probably not gonna be too impressed with the effects but maybe guys they are just targeting younger audience you know i feel like they are not targeting the OG community, you know, that fell in love with the older games. They're targeting new people. They're targeting kids. And kids play a lot of games. On a business perspective, I can probably understand why they're doing all this. And they are a company after all. They need to make profit, right? Oh, <laughs> just when i said it overall it looks like a game is made to appeal to kids i just said it bro <laughs> oh <laughs> how do you do fellow kids <laughs> this is really what ea is like trying to uh, be like at the moment oh bro <laughs> need for speed cartoon whoever made this you're the goat bro need for speed cartoon boys this is the actual name of the game everyone complaining about those cartoon effects when they can be turned off 
I'm a little bit more excited about this game now. If all of the effects are gone, it would look pretty similar to Need for Speed Heat, you know, just like another Need for Speed game. So guys, I don't think it's that bad. Then I guess boomers and zoomers can play together in uh, harmony. Younger people will use the cartoons, older people will disable it, everyone can enjoy the game. Boys, there is hope. And I will definitely be playing that game. If you want to see me play Need for Speed Unbound, make sure you subscribe because I will be playing that game. Drop that like as well. And as always, stay sideways.